Hi guys, charity shop gold or garbage. <laughs> Got a bit carried away today, I've bought three items. First one, Radio Control Jousting Knights. I think this is one of those Christmas specials from Marks and Spencers. They seem to get this sort of stock in around Christmas time. It's not their normal sort of items that they sell. £3.99. St Peter's Hospice at Yate. No idea if it'll work. And I have been saying I won't buy any more radio controlled cars. And that's really all these are. They've got wheels. And um, one's 27 megahertz, the other's 40 megahertz. I'll put some batteries in them later just to check whether they actually work or not. But I did think that might suit my grandchildren so they can play together. Because they'll fight over who gets the red one and who gets the blue one. But, well, we'll have a look at that later. So that's first purchase. Next, a kite. <laughs> a mini kite. 75 pence. Now, the reason I bought this is I am interested to see whether it works or not, but I saw these in another shop for a ridiculous price, several pounds, and there was no way I was going to pay, spend that sort of money for them. But 75 pence is probably still 25 pence more than I think it's worth. But I will be able to try it at some time. It's brand new, hasn't been taken out of the package. So, another kite. Oh, and that was... Oh yeah, 75 pence in Blue Cross. And then the final item. Nerf gun. Anybody who watches my channel knows that I'm not in favour of weapons. Uh, both of my, both, all four of my grandchildren play with Nerf guns already. So I won't be teaching them anything new. This was £1.95 in Blue Cross. It's one of those ones that needs batteries to operate it. So no idea if it'll work. I'm buying it because somebody's asked me to make a car or a vehicle radio controlled that goes along and then shoots projectiles and I thought that's a very light trigger. I've actually bought a little gun that shoots uh, foam discs and that has quite a stiff trigger on it which my servo will just about push but I reckon my servo will do this easily. I should be able to put a bit of wire through one of those holes, put the servo back here somewhere, and that will pull it to shoot it. Depends on whether it actually works with the batteries in it. And then when I've done that, I can give it to one of my grandchildren, because they will like it, assuming it works. So that's the three items. I did say, yeah, that one was Blue Cross as well, so that's two items from Blue Cross, which I think is an animal charity, I'm not sure, can't remember. And that one from St Peter's Hospice. I'll do separate videos on each one of them when we try them out. And there'll certainly be a video, separate video on that one, if I actually make it into a missile launcher car. <laughs> 